This is CNN Breaking News. Breaking news tonight as Vice President Kamala Harris unveils a brand new statue in New York. While trying to celebrate her love for Pfizer, she read a poem today at Times Square where she said this. This is a test for the race for gold, but my God, we will have to do our part to help Pfizer. I love Pfizer. I love them so much, I want to snog them in my quarters. I want my vagina to get wet as we play Star Wars together. Just thinking of them turns me on and makes me hard. I want to get dirty with them and play Rick Ashley as we do it on my bedroom. But my urges are wet and juicy. I can't contain myself. I can't stop thinking about Pfizer. He is strong and I am weak. But we're just meant for each other. My breasts are wet, I want it now. My ass is huge and I will hunt him down and squash him with my big giant fat ass as I laugh and say I love you. I will twerk for you as I tell you to get the jab and vote for me for president so I can impose more world economic forum policies. That is all for what I have to say. I'll be going to do it with Pfizer. See you all later. Bye. Kamala Harris was supposed to do a public speech about a George Floyd statue in New York today, but some people were shocked to see her read out a poem for her love for Pfizer instead. AOC has spoken to us at CNN today saying that she too has a large urge for Pfizer as well, whilst also saying that the proud black people should be treated as a priority over some for-profit pharmaceutical organization, and wrote that the Democrat Party absolutely, without a doubt, does not receive large donations from Pfizer. Now, as the impartial news network, we at CNN supports black people over any pharmaceutical organization and respects diversity and equality for all. Now, when we come right back, we'll be doing a live interview about a famous British politician named Matt Hancock, who survived the Australian forest, and I'm a celeb. Today's breaking news bulletin is brought to you by Pfizer. 